it's not financial advice, it's not legal advice for entertainment and educational purposes only and everything I say is my opinion. Please don't make any financial decisions based on anything I say in these videos. I'm actually in, in BJ's. Uh, I came here to pick up some things, but I wanted to put out a little quick video. Um, the market is, I believe, going to go into recession. And as the market get worse, I think it's going to make things better for AMC and GME investors. But that wasn't the real purpose of this video. The real purpose of this video is that if you follow my tweets, you see what I said about the SEC. The SEC allowing this market corruption to continue doesn't realize that once this play is done, a majority of investors, and not just in the United States, but all over the world, are going to lose. They already lost confidence in the market. And the only reason they're still in the play because they know it's going to squeeze. I mean, I know it's going to squeeze. I know we're going to get our attendees. But a lot of people, once AMC and GME squeezes, they are never going to get in the market again. They're never going to get in the market again. And and I'm sure the SEC is aware that the market only works with retail investors. Without retail investors, the stock market doesn't work. The stock market doesn't work. And I'm sure they're aware of that. But every day they allow the malfeasance to continue. Every day they allow the corruption and the fraud to continue. Every day they refuse to do their job more and more people lose confidence in the integrity of our stock market and like i said before it's not just here in the united states this is worldwide what's going to happen is american investors are going to start looking for investments in other countries they might start investing in canada and europe to get out of the um, united states stock market because our stock market has been revealed to be corrupt it has been revealed to be corrupt and that the, the fox is watching the hen house. Okay, the fox is watching the hen house. And when you look at everything that, 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 that's been going on in the last 18 months, I personally have come to the conclusion that the hedges don't outperform us because they're smarter than us. No, they outperform us because they can break the law. They can commit crimes with no consequences. Now... How much money can you make if you can break the law, if you commit crimes and nobody holds you to account? You can do whatever you want with no consequences. And that's why the hedges are performers year in, year out. Not because they are smarter than us. Not because they do more DD than us. Not because they have more information than us. It's because they are able to break the law and nobody does anything. I mean, they'll steal 20 billion and then get a million dollar fine. 20 billion and get a million dollar fine. Is that a, really a deterrent? No, it's not a deterrent. It's not a deterrent. It, 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 in fact, that emboldens the bad behavior. Okay, it emboldens ba the bad behavior. Anyway, listen, hit the like button, subscribe button, all that YouTube algorithm stuff. Let me know what you think. Um, I appreciate y'all that journal with me. God bless. Have a great day.